never look any of the games up. Never heard of any of these companies so far. That's always a good sign. Well, that's um that's a cover. Okay. God. We'll leave it on normal for now. Wait! This uses the analog stick! Chris, this is a PlayStation 1 game using the analog stick. I didn't realize there was more than Ape Escape. Why would I use- I have to use a R3 and L3 to shoot. The hell is a teeny weeny? Oh. Brilliant. This menu. This game is multiplayer. I have to go one at a time. Through the stamp. Rehearsal for Get Out the Vote promo. Take one. Wahoo! Hi, America! Hi, boys and girls! It's me, Tiny Tank! Cue the theme song. Tinky, tinky, clinky, clanky. New from Centrax, Tiny Tank. America's lovable. Wait, 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 wait. Is that my theme song? Well, it hasn't been finalized yet. Wanky, wanky, tanky, tanky, what the f is that? <laughs> You're being difficult. You're being an <laughs> I got a positronic brain. Oh, there, there, what you just did. That's the spirit we want. Who? A Centrax. It wants funding for a robot army. Ooh. To replace humans in wars. Ah, and I'm the cute little mascot. To, to get, get people, people to vote yes. Can I change my name at least? And to what? Mechanicor, Tank of Doom? From the top, Tiny. Tiny Tank is my slave name. Oh, please. Vote promo, take two. Tiny? Tiny's not here. I am Mechanicor, Tank of Doom! Look, Tiny, you're cute, and you're a killing machine. What's wrong with that? It's creepy. It's not creepy. It's cute. It's uh, cute. A cute killing machine? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I got an 80 millimeter cannon for a nose. Hey kids, is this cute? Oops. Okay, we'll wrap for the day, get another camera, try again tomorrow. You okay, Fred? I'm all right. A props, blanks for the tank next time? Can we talk about how this is an angel without arms or legs, but they still gave it a bust? It's literally a satellite with breasts.
What the hell is wrong with Sony in the 1990s? Ah. Oh. But yeah, the voice acting for PlayStation 1 game is actually quite nice. Earth, just as he destroyed you 100 years ago. Okay, I'll play along. Uh, who's Mutant? Our time has come. The new industrial revolution. A new world full of wonderful machines. Only this time we do not follow the whims of humans. We steer ourselves. There is no off switch to our destiny. Join us or get out of the way. To be fair, Chris, I think all of us could sleep well at night knowing there's no satellites that have breasts. I don't think that was needed. Just personally. But you're free to have your own artistic direction. Yeah, I'm not Bandtail. This game is actually very funny. Not sure what the hell is going on, though. This is the worst mission briefing ever. Oh god, what the hell is this? What are what are these controls? So what the hell is this? Like, like is this is this supposed to be playable? What the Now I know why this got like a two. God, this game controls like ass. Hey, you go, cowboy. It's firing backwards. No, no, the game is only 17 frames per second. Yeah, this is actually still is better than Assassin's Creed. That is not wrong.
shop by. There's literally nothing left alive. What shot? Oh, there's landmines. God, that was hard to see. So you're right, there is. We are a life form. If exposed to air, do we not rust? Uh, that. If forced to work in sandy areas with insufficient lubricant, do our gears not clog? Yet, despite our suffering, we will make this world possible free in the first place. The atmosphere will be gone, and oxidation will no longer ruin our smooth, shiny surfaces. That is my promise. Yeah, yeah, Wyndham. 
hat! So here's what I would say, if we don't finish this game today, I'm probably not going to come back to it. At least for now, this isn't really, wouldn't call it fun. Awkward. Like, there was a very similar Dreamcast game. That, I mean, that was more of like really weird, like rolling tanks and shit, but uh, this doesn't control well. Also, would necessarily call it fun. Brains. Let's go. So here's it, it seems like it wants to aim a bunch of guns also backwards. I don't know, but that made it ridiculously hard because the rockets took the front slots and now I had no guns shooting forward. And it kept like locking onto the barricade. <clears throat> Rehearsal, forget, forget out the vote promo two, take one. Tiny? Tiny. What? Lines? What are they? Fred? Fred? No, no I'm, I'm talking, talking to Fred. Fred. Fred? What? Tiny, Tiny lines? Hi there. Hi, Fred. No, no that's, that's your, your line. line. What? Hi, Hi there. Hi there. Good. Hi there. You know the Centrax motto? Bringing you peace one war at a time? Well, that's a way of life at Centrax. A yes vote on July 4th is a vote for sentient killing machines. They'll die. So you won't have to. Vote yes, and who knows? War fought by humans could be a thing of the past. Humans will be free to raise their families in safety. That's more than a promise. It's a hope. And at Centrax, hope is what life is all about. For hope, for life, vote yes. Good. That's the most mealy mouth bunch of crap I've ever heard in my life. I can't believe that came out of my mouth. Somebody shoot me. That's, That's right. right. Express, Express your rage. Your Let it spew. Let it out. Feel, Feel better? better? Yeah, lots. Not, Not you, Fred. Fred. Hi there. Hiya. Uh, stop, stop it. Cut, Cut it out. Cut. Cut. From, From the, the top. top. I will say the writing is good. Writing is very good. But I mean, a lot of old games had this nice comedy to it that was always nice. Like this... The game Medieval, Darkened Sky. The, Jack and, the first Jack and Daxter game. Ratchet and Clank. It was nice. Don't know why they stopped doing it. Mortar Villain Airfield is used to supply raw nanometal to remote locations around the globe. Destroy the transport ship and production of raw nanometal will be stopped. I keep the hat! It's impenetrable, but you may be able to inflict internal damage when it loads its cargo. Shoot at the flying cargo drones and they may explode inside the transport. Beware the mortars mounted on the cliff walls. Take them out first to make your mission easier. Good luck. <laughs> This just in. A mysterious force has destroyed the machine replicators at Dead River Canyon. However, Mutank, spokesman of the Revolutionary Steel Army, the army formerly known as Centrax, has assured us that planetary oxygen depletion will still proceed as scheduled. With the news oh! news, I'm Bob, Iron Witness News.
be honest, yes, the cutscenes are now honestly bad. The hot chocolate is very nice. I got so I purposely buy the tubs of Swiss Miss because the uh, the like packets are always very poorly proportioned. Let me see how many levels Tiny Tank is. Okay, there's twelve. So we're already two through. And that one was very quick. Apparently the game focused on a two-person multiplayer with your friends. Probably not, but it is there, but that is definitely a lie. I mean, this is one of the few analog stick PS1 games, and you can tell they had no clue how to program the analog stick. Like, this is floaty as hell. The raw material used to create nanometal is mined here. Find the boulder sheet and follow it up to the rock pulverizer. Destroy the pulverizer. Watch out for falling rocks. Good luck.
They changed that then. But yeah, so uh, the game itself also, the uh, voice dialogue is uh, completely bl like just blinded out by the shooting. supposed to do with this? I guess that. Apparently, double tapping also turns faster. Thanks for taking my call. I like to dance. Is that so wrong? Kinetic energy is a good thing, Strider. This is not too slight idling, but so long as friction is minimalized, motion is best. So yes, dance. Move forward. Yeah, Bedford, I could, I could honestly see a lot of people having an issue playing this. Like, I can't play shmups because there's just too much shit going on. Let's go. AD, ADHD doesn't do ignore most of the screen well, which is how you really play smups. You ignore most most of the screen. Also, benefit you are about to get an amazing cutscene. The game Let's does go. have great cutscenes. We have a final mix of your jingle, Tiny. Want to give it a listen? If I have to. Cue the music, Fred. Come and meet the new machine from Centrax. He's got a can of Boro nose. He's a little guy with a laser for an eye. He has metal treads instead of toes. That's me. He's got machine guns in his turret. He likes to talk to boys and girls. He's a funny little thing, and he loves to dance and sing. Most of all, he loves to save the world. Ding, ding, ding. It's cheesy. Clickety clack. Really cheesy. New from Centrax. Tiny Tank. You're tiny. 
Well, Tiny, what did you think? What is up with that tinky tinky? I thought it was kind of catchy. Shut up, Fred. God, this tank curse. Oh, also, for some reason, the, uh, ho the, like, home satellites that are, like, beaming the info to me and all of my instructions is, like, a giant breasted angel-shaped satellite in space. I don't know why. The Wakey Nightmare Tank Simulator. Though, this is a PlayStation 1 game that uses analogs. The... The, the second one I've ever seen. This experimental transport system will soon be able to travel anywhere in the world, carrying the minerals used to make positronic brains. It is protected by this energizer, which renders the train cars invincible. Your mission, destroy the energizer and destroy the train. The giant strider bots fancy themselves well. This game for an important announcement. An important and very expensive piece of equipment called the Polarizer was vandalized today by the troublesome saboteur called Tiny Tank. Once again, New Tank stresses the need to nail that yellow pest for good. What news you can use? I'm Bob, Iron Witness News. He's falling and he can't get up. Bye bye, noodle head. Please lock on to the enemies and not the invincible train. Like, holy shit. Uh, please lock on to the guy in your face. Why did you give me control of the, if you're just going to auto lock on everything? What is the literal point of this? If you're gonna lock on to everything you aren't supposed to be hitting because it's completely immune to damage. Bye bye, little head. He's falling and he can't get up. No clue what the hell I'm supposed to be shooting at, but those guys apparently don't take damage. He's falling and he can't get up. You destroy the train now. No. instructions.
An infinite number of times it's a PlayStation 1 Keep game. PlayStation 1. Get it, Chris? Yes, they keep saying the same jokes. Question is, where the hell do I have to go? I can store shit. I believe we all know that I'm dead. I, I do not know what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing here. Oh, I'm I'm looking this up. It's gonna be something stupid. There is literally nothing. Hold on, that is not what's... Okay, let's reset this. And... 
I don't know why, but his game is controlling way better than mine is. Now, while we can probably agree no one on Duck Station's ever tested this game, um... I fucking hate this so much. Now it just magically works. Bye-bye, Noodlehead. 
Maybe I should see a doctor. Losing so many extra lives for no reason. Can I please just get onto the goddamn platform and leave without getting rocketed as soon as I'm trying to move? Great that I know now that I can move those. Just locking on to all these stupid metal things and not the uh, enemy I'm trying to fight. Wow, I hate this.
really? Why couldn't I just jump to the to the stupid platform? Why? To wait for one of them to cool and then jump. I I still don't understand what the hell I'm doing here. Nice merchandise. Back to that video. I still have no clue what the hell is going on here. Apparently I'm doing it right, it's just uh, doesn't want to work. Thank you, I'll be here till Sunday. I don't understand. This is just awful. Bloated plutocrat.
I'm gonna give this like five more minutes, and if it just doesn't want to work, Thank you. I think we're done with this game. Oh my god, it finally worked. I said it jumped way off the map. That was dumb. Let's go. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, Centrax is pleased to introduce Tiny Tank. Hi, everybody. Boys and girls, moms and dads. You know, war has been around for as long as human beings have been around. Hundreds and thousands of years. You ever been in a war? Uh, me? No, no I'm, I'm, I'm no, no soldier. soldier. So you have soldiers to fight your wars for you? Well, they're not, not my not wars, wars, Tiny. Right? Whose wars are they, then? Well, okay, I guess they belong to all of us. Me too? Not, Not exactly. exactly. You were made to fight our wars for us. Yeah? And what do we get out of it? Our thanks. Glory. Oh boy, nothing machines like better than thank yous and glory. Let's get back to work. Fred, you ever killed anybody? Thought about it. There's an idea. Maybe we should all just think about killing. Sure, I can do that. Careful, Fred. We might have to put you back on your medication. Cut. Back to one. This is the Centrax storage facility for nanometal. Disable the cooling robots. If you overheat the nanometal mountain, it will explode. You must heat the entire mountain to destroy it. Shoot it from all sides and avoid cooling it with cooling guns. In this situation, we look. Attack the robots on the bottom, please. 
something. Back to the other video, because I need to know what the hell I'm doing here. Oh, of course. His thing actually lets him shoot. Him. Oh, I apparently lost my hat at some point. like no extra lives after like the first two freaking levels. Let's go. You could have infinitely farmed on the first one, but now uh too bad. I can't help but feel there should be words here. Underground recycling center. Nanometal is scarce. So, Centrax is maximized recycling. This base is maintained by a stealth tank. He must be destroyed. Beware. 
This isn't annoying. Lock on to the Down tank we're fighting. Not something through the wall. Here. Great ball of fire. non compost metal. Hey, wait up. Great ball of fire. phrase things properly. Let's try this again, shall we? Tiny Tank is just a mascot, a joke, 
a leftover from the human age. We destroyed him once. Let's do it again, shall we? Back with your calls after this. Are you shooting more and hitting less? Wish you could shave some CPU cycles off your tracking software? Now there's relief. TOS, targeting optimized software. TOS will increase your accuracy rate by a full 5% or your money back. Order it by name, TOS. Download a demo version and a replicator near you. Act now and receive at no extra charge, you take a life. Unique audio program that has inspired millions. TOS, you take a life. Order now. You can't miss. Now to take your call, here's you. I hate this. Hoover Tank in the Atmosphere Production Center, you're on the air. Hey, Victor. I don't have wheels or treads. I hover on cushions of air. Whenever I fire my impulse gun, I skid out of control like a hockey puck. I need traction. Bad. Would you recommend a good cosmetic surgeon? I'm disappointed in you, Hoover. You are as you were meant to be. There are no design flaws. The only thing you need to change is your attitude. Use your head, work the angles, make the recoil factor work for you. Good luck, you tank killers. Strike blimp, you're on the air. Roger, when Tiny Tank is caught in the glare of my spotlight, I will rain bombs upon this puny yellow carcass. There won't be enough left of him for a fix-it crab to fix. Over. Now that's the can-do attitude I'm looking for. Roger, however, I'm a little concerned about open flames. Should I worry? Over. Don't let fear paralyze you. Listen to me, all of you. All my dear, dear followers, Hoover Tank moves through the world virtually friction-free. The downside, slight loss of control when firing. Strike Blimp is a deadly balloon ready to rain doom upon any intruder's head. And yes, probability is the price you pay God to damn it, these air. controls are awful. Air will soon be a memory. Only Tiny Tank stands between us and a perfect world. He is the flaw, not you. New tank has spoken. Forward on the ball bearings of fate. Tomorrow belongs to steel. Back to work. And the waiting. Spice a lot.
the enemies, please. And not the button we don't need to shoot. Why would you put aim assist in a game like this? And we're going to despise everything, Regdrin. I want my head back. Antagonistic. I want my head back. Woo! Antagonistic. I want my head back. Antagonistic. I want my head back. I'm screwed. God, this I this is weird. I want my head back. Oh! That's actually... I was not expecting this. That explains why that jank just happened. I just wish that boss fight was explained properly so I didn't just lose my last extra life for no reason. I was not expecting an apology because he was out of memory, so he has to split the level in two. Ow, ow, well, I'm dead. going to restart that entire jank game again. If it gives me extra lives and continues here, I'll go. Otherwise, I'm not going to do it. The game is really awful to play. Well, thanks for being here, everyone. Uh, I'm going to, uh... I may come back to it. Probably not, but, uh... I guess let's go read into someone playing Armored Core 4. <laughs>